Gude. This will be a quick video, but one about a topic that I was thinking about for decades. You see, here we have like two major brands of fountain pens. One is Lamy and the other one is Pelican. And they differ in the cartridge size. You see, the top cartridge is really long and the other one is quite short and stubby. They have about the same diameter, but they don't fit into the competitor's pen. The problem is the smaller cartridges are really inexpensive and the other ones are of course expensive. This led me to having lots of these tiny cartridges in my drawer, but no fountain pen and the fountain pen for the bigger cartridges but no cartridges anymore because like five of the big cartridges are like one euro fifty or so and therefore i came up with the idea to print an adapter or an adapter for it which enables me to put the small cartridge into the other fountain pen and you see one of the drawbacks is that they get stuck in there but you can take like a wood screw and just pop it out again um, let's try this. This is a fountain pen. I didn't use it for like years and yeah, you see it's, it's really dried up. So let's pop the adapter on the small cartridge and let's pop the little ball in there like this. Yeah, you see there's a little ink on the tweezers. It fits into the fountain pen and yeah, let's, let's go. Let's go. Here you see, I think, or at least I was able to see the ink starting to fill up in the little reservoir down there. And I started scribbling and scribbling and just trying to make the ink flow through the fountain pen again. Maybe I should have put it into water, this might have helped it. But here we go, finally, it's working again. Hooray, the adapter works. In the description below you can find the link to the Thingiverse STL file if you like to print it yourself. Um, be aware this is hard plastic so maybe it might leak over time so no guarantee taken for that. And yeah, enjoy writing with your new fountain pen.